I guess we should probably just start with, I'm, I'm going to prep her hair. And, um, and that's, that's crucial because the wig, of course, has to be secure, particularly in the ballet world. The pin curls aren't quite the same because their hair is basically, that, the female dancer's hair is, is it a chignon or French twist or something like that. And so it's not quite as secure as this because this allows the, the wig pins to slide under and secure you know, the wig to the head. So there's no chance of it coming off. So you can see you know, these types of pin curls on the, if you turn your head to the side. When I put the wig on, then larger pins will slide through the foundation of the wig once it's on her. And underneath these, and these will be my security for, for the wig to not move around. Now that her hair is prepped, I'm going to put on everyone's favorite part, the stocking cap, which basically just <laughs> holds it all down. So, so um, foundation, your doll, right? Yeah. I believe okay. So. You tell me. <laughs> <laughs> She's doll, I think. Yes. So I'm going to put a fairly pale foundation on. So this is Arabian, and all I do in this five-minute makeup is put a very vivid. Oh, it's very bright. Yes. <laughs> we're not going for a natural here. I I like to make the eye nice and big and wide and open. So I'm just going to use your eyebrow to be sort of the crease of the eyelid. And then I'll put a new eyebrow on you. The lips, the lips are so important. This sort of does the trick enough. This is crucial. I'm gonna do your bottom lip. So we'll get to the wig, because that's, that's the real. And there we go. Wow, it's amazing. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's so simple, really.